Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So on the today's video, I'm going to explain you about the eight kinds of noun. The first, we have common noun. In the common noun, we have four types. What is a common noun? A common noun is a non-specific people, places, things or ideas. Example, men, city, religion, etc. Second, we have a proper noun. A proper noun is something which is specified. People, places, things. Example, Albert, Einstein, London, etc. These are the person's name we can specifically understand. Third, we have an abstract noun. Abstract noun is something you cannot preserve with your five senses. It means you cannot see it, but you can feel it. Example, belief, love, pride, happiness, etc. Fourth, we have concrete noun. Something that you can preserve with your five senses. Example, apple, lion, ice, flower. Which you can feel it when you touch it. Also, which are visible to our eyes. And fifth, we have a countable noun. Countable nouns are those nouns which we can count. <laughs> Example, pencil, apple, apples, train, clock, which we can count in the numbers. Now we have uncountable noun. Uncountable nouns cannot be counted in numbers. For example, milk, music. Now we have compound noun. Compound noun are those noun that are made up of two or more similar words example text book that is this word is made with two words as well as one more example i will say snowball sea food sunflower now we have collective noun collective noun refer to the group of things as a whole in the collective name you can understand that it is a collective noun which are in a groups example bunch audience flock group now we have singular noun singular means one refer to the one person one place thing example cat one cat dog ship monkey not monkeys if it is a monkeys it's a collective noun now we have last plural noun plural noun refers to more than a one person or places things or ideas example dogs cat cats fishes in the collective noun you have more than five things example a bunch of people not two people when if it is a two people it is a plural when it is a when it is a one it is a singular so I hope you understand. Stay tuned for the next video.